<laughs> what is this? What's going on everyone? Nick Kiger here. Kiger strength. So it's been a little while. New hair, new year, everything. But uh, no, I think I've seen you guys since the January 1st. But anyway, um, I'm now officially prepping for my, prepping my meat, as Brandon Campbell would say for the March meet, March 25th, I believe it is. So as I said, I'm gonna do a nine week prep um, and that has officially started. So uh, we're gonna get this going and um, see how it goes. Full length mirror in the SMG bathroom. This should come in handy. Show a Fiji I was cool And when I finally got sober Felt ten years older But fuck it, it was something to do I'm living out in L.A. I drive a sports car just to prove I'm a real big baller Cause I made a million dollars And I spend it on girls and shoes But you don't wanna be high like me Never really know why like me You don't ever wanna step up right there. Hopefully you can hear me over the music because I'm an example of some of the bad habits I have, especially when going for, when I know I'm going for reps on the deadlift. Um, you know, I tend to kind of rush them. And as you saw on that set, uh, I did not do a good job of engaging my lats. I did not do a good job of pulling the slack out of the bar and my hips were shooting up. So, um, that is not what I want to happen at all. So that's something I'm gonna to have to, I gotta keep in mind on deadlift. I have that tendency to rush them. Um, so I just gotta get into my head. Maybe I'll have to completely reset each um, rep. Or, uh, uh, but I'm gonna to have to do something to, you know, make sure I don't get too sped up in my own head. Right anyway, now I'm gonna drop it down, change to a stiff bar actually, and really work on the things that I just mentioned.
So after I finished deadlifting and Oak finished squatting, um, we both went on to bench. Uh, both wanted to bench today, uh, so it worked out well. Um, I let them work in. Uh, you know, you got to let the weaker guys work in sometimes. Um, I know, you know, his poverty bench needs to improve. So, um, you know, I tried to help him out here. But uh Anyway, here he is doing some close grip. Um, a quick update on my programming. Like I mentioned, the cocktail programming from a couple uh, videos ago. Still doing that. Um, I did mention that I was going to base the main list off the TSA Intermediate. I kind of scrapped that idea. I um, spent a few hours a couple days ago going over, um, just looking over some principles that I liked in RTS and kind of formulating a plan based on that. Uh, for these ne next uh, nine weeks to peak for this meet. You can see Oak here doing some duffel o bar bench, and I've actually I actually like the look of these, and I programmed them in for myself for at least a few weeks of this coming uh, nine week prep. So looking forward to doing these. Like they look kind of fun to try. I've obviously never tried them before, uh, but on this particular day after bench, I moved on to some overhead press, and I have not done this movement in like a year and this is honestly one of my favorite movements and probably one of my strongest movements too obviously not now since i haven't done it in a year but um i'll show you a quick flashback to me when i was at my peak of doing overhead press and um it was actually like my favorite lift but just kind of stopped doing that uh realized because my it didn't help my bench at all my bench stalled for that whole year as my overhead press just kept getting better but um it was it was definitely fun to keep improving in that lift definitely one of the best lifts there is in my opinion one of the most impressive Back. Push it back. Push it back. There you go. 